Hello, Legion Arkle here, back in Persona 3 Portable Maniac Solo Female Named Protagonist Run. Uh, it's always a mouthful. So, uh, let's continue on with where we left off. Straight where we left off. So, um, I do want to check town a little bit. Mainly, I want to check the crane game. Tanaka's here, that's fine. No, press the wrong button. Jack Frost doll, yes. This might take a while. I actually don't know how many Jack Frost dolls I have. That's one. Give me one more, give me one more, because I'm so sure I've got at least one. This isn't gotcha anymore. That's two! This isn't the gotcha anymore, this is me actually uh, optimizing things. Come on, one more. Let's give you one more. <laughs> one more, come on. <laughs> one more, one more. Ah, oh, seriously. <laughs> this is gotcha, 100%. One more, one more. One more. Ah! I got two, like, almost in a row. Now it's taking forever to skip this one. One more, one more. Come on, that was a different sound. Really? One more, one more. Okay, fine. Uh, go to Kurosawa, because I... Yeah, because I help those people. I couldn't make out the full picture for questioning him, but you're the ones who saved him, right? The place can't accept gifts, so he's yours. Keep these some for you kids. 40! There's still more. I found out the missing girl the other day, they tried questioning her, but her answers didn't make any sense. You see some kids saved her from attack from a, by a black foot, which we actually saw during Tartarus. Okay, that's a nice attention to detail. Skirt of Chivalry. Uh, I doubt... Yeah, no, I doubt it. Plus two strength. I think I can buy this. Actually, no, I already have a. I already have, I already have one. What am I doing? Robe of Warding. Mantle of Wind. Robe of Scriptures. That's fine. Accessories. Excuse me? Gain Suka at the beginning of battle. Gain Raka at the beginning of battle. Tara at the. Giga lock bands as well. Oh my plus ten. Oh I already have like order Tarakaja. Order Rakukaja would be pretty nice. Uh, in time, in time, in time. Uh Devil, Taka, one more time. He maybe Oh, or not. Okay, I thought I was going to talk about employer, em, employ, employee again. Yeah. Sounds troublesome? Indeed it was. I had to pay for transportation, membership renewals, and of course my hotel room. I don't understand how I feel, but since you're young, but a high school reunion is a very important event. It's the perfect opportunity to show everyone how you... How you pathetically... How uh, how everybody are... Ah! It's the perfect opportunity to show everyone else how pathetically their lives turned out. Their lives turned out. Right, right. Uh, for example, I ran into a classmate who used to make fun of me for... 
only having rice in my bento. And then another fellow who only strung up my holy sockets on the flagpole. Now they both look at me with envy, the annual salary doesn't even compare to my monthly income. My business is on a roll and my permanent life is very satisfying. Let me take you under my wing as a classical model, it is a once in a lifetime opportunity. Don't think I would extend this offer to just anyone. Yeah, he's really pushing this. I don't know whether I can actually trust him though. <laughs> By the way, remember that 40k you gave me? I think we can call it even. My time is worth less than 100,000 yen per hour. <laughs> think of all the free advice I've given you. And he left. Alright. Free day. Who's up? Who's up? Oh! Yeah, it's okay. I was wondering if you'd like to go out somewhere, out someplace with me today. Oh, gladly. I'm actually wondering if you actually do decline, somebody else comes in to um, ring you. Not only is it relatively cheap, but the balance of ingredients is well thought out too. Oh, she's researching. <laughs> And they seem to be really thinking about the health of the customers too. This I am plentiful meal is really good for women. Well, here is a surprise question for you. What happens if your body doesn't get enough iron? I'm so sure it becomes you're anemic. I'm so sure that's why anemic is. Anemic? Conditions in which the blood doesn't have healthy blood cells, reduce oxygen flow. Wait, is it? Iron deficiency. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was alright. I was alright. <laughs> I get anemic all the time, so I try hard to get enough iron in my diet. Uh, give a present? Yes, sure. Um, I'm not giving her the food. <laughs> Jack Frostall. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Oh, looks like no Tartars today. Uh, this time I'll go to academics. Finish up studying. Hmm. Oh, Kari. In about a week there's gonna be another mission. Is it that time already? <laughs> we just have to keep fighting until we defeat all eight that are left. But what are we gonna do after that? We've been wondering about this for a while. I wonder if Mitsuru Senpai is hiding something from us. Huh. Oh. Oh no. Exams in two weeks. Wait, two weeks? Okay. Uh... When you drain the water in a tub, it twirls down the drain. Which way does it. Which way does the spiral go into. go in the northern hemisphere? Um, I'm reminded of that Simpsons episode, that Australian one episode actually, but that was talking about the Southern Hemisphere. Northern Hemisphere draining water direction. Is it clockwise? I'm just getting clockwise. Clockwise. 
the side of the hemisphere moves anti anti-clockwise. Clockwise it is. Eh? Oh! It, it was referring to the south! Whoops. I didn't read the question properly! <laughs> Planning to. Okay, Rio, it is. Yeah, the the, the teacher actually say it was was the southern hemisphere. Whoops, I read it wrong. Yeah, this was me actually looking it up though, but I didn't read it. It was southern. <laughs> Forget it. Oh, she's dazed. I mean, if you're not gonna act like your normal self, this might be the worst club at the school. Look who's talking. You're not fighting, you don't pay attention. It's because of Kenji, isn't it? You haven't gotten over him. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, easiest, easiest option. Yeah, best spirit. It's going right now. Okay, go, go, go. <laughs> Confusion time! Do you like me? I'm just bluntly stating it, alright? Yeah, he's hopeless. Make that goofy look off your face. <laughs> He's either dense or he himself is a little bit. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay. If he likes me that much, he. If he likes me as much as he likes ramen, I'll be happy. Sorry, eight. I thought it was only at seven. Man, I'm gonna finish somebody's. Wait, what? Well, why don't we call it today's practice and go over to walk? Oh, walk is a wild duck. Okay, she just abbreviated it. I thought she was just going a little bit dazed herself again. Never mind. It's okay. What's on your mind? Well, um, I was hoping you could do me a favor with your skill. Bing. I was doing some research on our school, and I came across something strange. Ten years ago, a lot of students missed school for some reason. They were reported as absent, but I found some records that suggest it was something serious. Hmm. Do you know anything about it, Fuka? Me? Um, not really. I know it was a long time ago, but... Doesn't it seem suspicious to you? From what I've heard, this isn't the first time shadows have appeared. Wait, are you saying? I don't know, but I wonder. Hmm. And I'm not trying to make trouble, but Mitsuru Senpai acts kind of weird whenever someone asks questions about Tartarus. Yukari is right about that. Is she? 
I just want to know what happened back then. If it doesn't have anything to do with the shadows, then fine. I understand. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Where have you been? Like, the reason why I say that is because she's subtle about it, but at some points the subtlety can actually, you know, reverse on itself and saying that, yeah, she is hiding something. Considering what Yukari said about, oh, if we talk about anything about, anything about what Tartarus is, Mitsuru shuts up. So, yeah. Um. Oh, wait, Mondays. That was Fuka as well. Eh, uh, it doesn't matter. I think Tuesdays is free ish? Sorry. Sorry. Yes. Okay, and it seems like nobody wants me to be checking out the books, so... Uh, no. They're... Everybody's making rumours. Yep. You just hung out with her? Seriously? She'll do anything you ask. It's like she can't say no. And I kicked them out. <laughs> All those things about me having and seducing boys, acting superior. I don't care about how other people see me, but I don't. But I want you to know that. I believe in you. I believe you. As long as you understand, I don't need anything else. Okay, I got both right answers. Even though she says she doesn't care, is she really. Is this really the truth? Yeah, I don't think so. She's hiding it. That seems like nothing more than confessing to all the lies being said. Let's clear up these lies up. Make them see the truth. Using the announcement? Oh no. That's a can do it. She's doing it. We're actually doing it. I didn't know that speaking from the heart was this terrifying. It feels good when your feelings match your words. I've heard that before, but never believed it. You're the one who made me feel that way before, and I'm going to do this because you believe in me. Nine. One left. One left for Sari. I don't know how it would be used and I deeply regret not, regret not considering that when I agreed to have it, to let it be taken. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. Saying that that isn't true, if I recall, the one who tried to cover up the truth about that was. Don't you start pulling racing on me. 
no. <laughs> the teachings are kind of kind but strict, and I have friends who believe in me. I'm very sorry that I caused all, all of you students, faculty, any trouble. I'm very sorry from the bottom of my heart. Is this going out all over? Maybe sorry, joined the drama club. <laughs> no. Oh boy, this is crazy. If you stay here, I'm going to begin the handy <laughs> Uh, okay. If I say it's my idea, it's gonna be kind of bad. You kind of need to direct it to say it is Tahari's idea. Yeah, you kind of kind of screwed this up, obviously. Are you the one going on every day about how I should be taking on more duties as a teacher? I'd be better to see a report about this when this is over. Oi! <laughs> and it just, yeah, passed the buck over, whatever. <laughs> Something about how we all sat down and we should be. Should I've given this more full blah blah blah, or should I do it? What she did made me feel a lot better too. I don't know how many times I've reprimanded my students for gossiping, but they just won't listen. You must have been taking must have taken guts to stand up for yourself like this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even want to s want an essay out of you. Well, ended good, I guess. Where have you been? Um, I guess nothing is happening. Uh, let's talk to the devil again, I guess. <laughs> Since I'm going social like grinding. Yep. Kind of? Well, you can tell. I have my hair revitalized. Does it look healthier now? I'm afraid it's all part of the job to have my friends to think of. At home, I'm completely the opposite. Dressed like a slob and only shower once every three days. Let me give you an analogy. Vegetables. Perfect. Okay. Imagine an organically grown cucumber that looks deformed. Compared to that of a cucumber that looks perfect, but was grown using chemical fertilizer and pesticides. Which one do you think in the supermarket would stock? The one that looks good. It's always like that. All good shaped cucumbers are difficult to stack, so stores prefer nice straight ones. Which is, yeah, true actually. Taste and safety are not really considered instead they carry cucumbers, they even mould one eat. So why do consumers still buy these cucumbers when they know the truth? Simple, people trust what they see, appearance matters most. That's why as much as I hate spending money I buy expensive ties to win people's trust. Wait, you remember what I just said about me dressing like a slob and not showering every day? <laughs> Don't tell anyone. I can't afford to have people start believing I'm ordinary. I only see that because it was you, you're the only one who knows. Yeah, a little bit of double sided there. I think he's seven now? Yeah, he's seven. Alright. Okay, I believe. Yeah, I know what's going on. Yeah. 
Yep, we got a week. We got a week. Guess what I'm going to tell you? I think so. <laughs> You're used to it by now, huh? The next full moon will be in one week. Yep. Are you prepared? Be careful, okay? I'll come again. July. Totally. July, July 7th at midnight. Now remember, incidents increase when a full moon is near, so remain alert at all times. Lunchtime. Wednesday, planning to. Yeah, so it's just Rio. Perfect. I know exactly where to go. If you guys are wondering, I'm like neglecting Jinpei. I'll get to it at some point. I just really want to work on Re like I'm basically working on Rio, Sari, and Fuka, basically at this point. So since I'm juggling so many, I can't exactly get anybody else done or just ready. So, it's better for me to finish one of those three and then I can slot in somebody else afterwards. We should call her Phoenix. Phoenix and Rio. Why not just call her Runix? Phoenix Lux. Oh, I cannot say that. Phoenixaki sounds too good, but. Though it sounds like some kind of mod, it does. Hey, if you don't stop fla flapping your jaws, my next is going straight for your face. Okay, she's. Yeah. <laughs> well, Rio going on a good date. I really think everyone's committed to the team now. Well, no, I know they were all committed to each other the whole time, yeah. I didn't take the time to see who excelled in which position. Mark, you know, from now, from the looks of it, you're going to be the team together. You really have an eye for details. Seriously, you're much better leader than I am. Thanks. Rio seems calm, as if she's matured a little. Ooh, okay. That's what I needed. Nine! Okay, yeah. Hmm. I was expecting something bigger to be a nine, but okay. Where have you been? Yup. <sighs> That means it's gonna be a Star Festival special bout. Just <laughs> uh, get this one over with. Oh, come on. <laughs> Could be enough to actually get to the next academics. Oh. Hmm. Anyone else? Thursday means oh no. Sorry. Not today. Since Sari's already at nine, I think I think I can give some time to Fuka. <laughs> Yes. It's not a problem with how I make the recipe, how do I put this? 
while I'm making it, I start thinking that it's not going to come out right anyway. It's like I'm bad at imagining things in a positive way. Yeah, I say that I'm kind of like that as well. If there, were only, if there was something I was actually good at. You good with machines. Once my dad told me to work on complicated music equipment, he fixed things like broken amplifiers and headphones. We once I would be broken. I loved watching and working on those things when I was little. That's probably why I became good at machines. But I don't think I could use machines to repay everyone's kindness. We we really need help with fighting more technology. We have Kiriju's group's support. I want to find something that only I can do, something that people rely me on. I'll help you find it. If you want to make something that can take back to everyone, I think cookies would be the best. Cool, alright. Ah, uh, being methodical, I see. Yeah, yeah, expected. In order to avoid staying any lights into the night, you're just doesn't have a freaking cook. You somehow defended the dough from all the food because it seems to deviate from the recipe. All the cookies survived. This up. I want to get academics up just a little. Really? Not even that? Third. Okay, so it looks like three more days. Last time I was out with my boyfriend, he was heading to Shirakawa Boulevard. I know what was on his mind. We just started dating by Mori just kind of disgusted he got such a dirty mind. Maybe I should dump him. I don't want to be the subject to one of those rumors that goes a couple was found unconscious. Huh. Yeah, we keep hearing about couples like something weird happening to them. As you all know, there are many theories about the author Murasaki Shikibu. Huh. That the Genji Monogatari had a different author, that Murasaki Shikibu was his cheap pin name. Some must have even suggested that Murasaki Shigibu was an alien from outer space, an intriguing theory. You've probably seen her portrait, it's printed on the 2000 yen bill. That I don't know. But there is one thing you might not know about Murasaki Shigibu. That's the way in which her achievement was recognized worldwide. Does anyone know? Junpei? Huh? Me? Uh... Um, <laughs> Rasaki Shikibu achievements, and I better not see any fake grand order stuff with this page. Yeah, tells of Genji. Uh, come on, come on. Go back, go back. Tells of Monogatari. Tells of Genji. Tells of Monogatari. Uh... I doubt it's Nobel Peace Prize. Was it? Uh... Hmm. 
Hold on, let me look this up. Composition <sighs> tells tells of that. Hmm. I am going to go with. I don't know why. Like, constantly kicking it wrong now. Friday. Oh, I can finish somebody's off. I can finish off Rio's. Let's see if I can, anyways. Okay, maybe not yet. Maybe not yet. Good enough for me. I'm gonna get my academics up one more time. Seriously, still hasn't increased. How long does it take? Oh, okay. Saturday. That means we go over it. Yes. Oh, we're going for sweet now. Cupcakes, alright. Let's make it together. Oh boy. That's sugar. Making cupcakes, correct? Uh, should I use my hands to mix it in? I know. Use your hands when you're making hamburger patties. Does it really matter? Be it a whisk or a spatula? I think whisk, isn't it? You did your best too. <laughs> I'm so happy that I was able to make something so difficult, all thanks to you. Oh, that's five. Two of them. So I guess if you do it like all correctly, there's a chance you can just get two, which is pretty good. Welcome back. Fourth. Full moon on Tuesday. Full moon on Tuesday. Okay, devil time. And he is here. Okay, perfect. Yep, Jack Frost doll. Oh, I tried this twice, that's it. Won't waste much time on this. Perfect! On the second try! <laughs> yeah, I'll take that. Yes. Alright. I'm used to being accosted by people, but recently I had an interesting encounter. It was with a young man, not much older than you. Guess what he said? He said, thank you. Did you hear wrong? I was as surprised as you, so I asked him to repeat himself. But sure enough, that, 
that's what he actually that's what he said i was shocked someone actually th actually thanking me for selling fake products but then he told me he quit his part-time job and was going to study to become a public prosecutor <laughs> he wants to punish businessmen like me for bending the rules he said i was an example of a negative role model as if this is me worrying too much, but what if, just what if, what if he becomes a public prosecutor and puts me behind bars? Then I won't be able to give you any more advice. That's... He is very easy to actually rank up, oddly enough. Like, very easy. Apparently, kids these days aren't as naive as we thought. Yeah, that one's great. Okay, two more. It's not school today, but who's gonna talk? Who was it? Rio. She's at nine, correct? Let's get one done, I guess. First team rank, I hope. Yes, I'll accept. Although, does the, does the weekdays constitute as giving you another rank up, or is it just increase it just slightly so that the next time in school is the only time you can actually rank them up? I'm not exactly too sure how it works. Oh, right, right. But I've never gone to a group date before, so I don't know what to do. Uh, um, you just chat. You just chat. Talking with people has actually gotten kind of more fun for me lately. After I spill my guts to the rest of the club, I understand the better now. Um, it worked before. So maybe she does like the Jack Frost doll? Yeah, okay, okay. So I think weekends... Weekends is only when you can give... Like, you can increase it faster so that when we go to the school next day, that is when the actual rank up happens. Because I believe when that happened to me with Sari, Sari's was the one I did kind of screw up, but more or less, it's always the next time at school the rank up happens. It always did that because I got most of the questions right, but for Sari, I got it didn't work out to the affection, wasn't high enough for me to actually go on to the next event for Sari. So Sari was a different situation, but Rio, I think the next time or the next, like the next time I talked to her at school, She'll be finally at rank 10. This was just a push up just to do that. I believe that's what it does. Because I haven't got a rank up at all during the weekends. I, I think I'm right about that. Yes! Finally! Now I can increase something else. That's perfect. Okay, now today, just so I don't soft lock, soft lock myself, I'm going to save on save in Tartarus in this day. Yeah. Uh, let's see how far. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I might. This might be a long, longer episode than I thought. Who was it? Rio. Planning to. So what I think I'll do is I'll end the episode at finishing off Rio's social link. I'll save up in Tartarus, and then next episode is when I'll be facing off as to what the full moon's gonna give, bring us. Yes.
you know you can leave me out, I don't need a boyfriend. You need, you need a better man to love than Kenji, seriously. I don't think one exists. Great, then we all don't. This feels like it was a while back when it was just us two practicing together. Stuff like group dates and everything, they're all being nosy, aren't they? I never thought about asking other people about things like love. I thought it was right to sacrifice everything to invite myself to the club. No matter how tough things got, knowing I was getting better and showing up results would relieve my suffering, but I have forgotten something very important, to have fun. Forget Forgot the joy of volleyball. Take take a look at this. I thought she just I thought she was about to give me something. It's a beginner guide. When I first started playing volleyball, I was so excited I couldn't even sleep. I'd read this in my bed while I ate even during class. I wanted to give this to you. I want you to have the thing that gave me so much inspiration back then. I think it'll help me remember that I'm not alone. So please. Annotated guide. I'll cherish this. It's all because of you that I came to realize all these things. You've been with me every step of the way, giving me extra push that I needed. You always keep an eye out for those around you. Oddly enough, Rio was actually my first rank up that I actually did in this game, so it's actually befitting that she's also my first rank 10. Boom! Maxed! Maxed Chariot! Oh! Oh, I've never seen this happen. What's... Oh, is it happening? The innermost power of Chariot Arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Thor, the ultimate of the Chariot Arcana. Oh, I never knew this was an actual bonus. You can make Thor? Interesting. Okay, yeah, yeah. I should also tell you one thing. Um, my first playthrough, I believe it was... I believe I got up to around June, so I never got up to the next. Like, I, I defeated the Emperor and Empress fight, but I stopped there. So, anything beyond this point is completely blind. I don't know what's, I don't know what's going to happen unless I look it up on my phone for um, mini side quests. But for stuff like this, I, this is the first time I've actually seen this happen. As long as I keep thinking that way, that will never... Things will never turn out right. Maybe the same thing can be said about life too. Ah. <laughs> Tomorrow's day. If we lose, then pretty soon the city will be full of the lost. Just thinking about it gives me the willies. We better win. It's all on our shoulders. Dude, I don't know if we'll sleep tonight, if we want to go to Tartarus, count me in. Okay, speaking of that, save. On both. I need to save on both. So this is my first backup. And then, my second backup becomes... It's Tartarus. This is just so I don't soft lock myself because I'm doing this as this maniac solo run. Because if I can't defeat the boss, and if I'm stuck in the boss's domain, I am screwed. So it's better for me to make some backups just in case. Okay, and then. Um. All of that is fine. Actually, no, it isn't. Yeah, give me that. Yeah, we could. We could. Actually, no, oh, you know what? Samuel. I thought Samuel. Yes. 
Oh, wait, no. Uh, <laughs> I'll end the episode here because I, I should have, like, stinned off this episode before I went outside. So I'll leave the episode here, and the next episode we will deal with the next full moon shadow. So until next time, LA out.